What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Inside the Horseshoe. My name is Matt, and the Colts have announced that they are releasing kicker Eddie Pinero. And to me, this is a pretty big surprise. Um, I thought he was going to stay on the team for another week or two because both him and Rodrigo Blankenship have not missed a kick in the preseason so far. He's looked really good in preseason, so I thought, okay, this kicking battle is going to go past that third preseason game, and then we'll have our decision on whether um, Hot Rod gets cut or Eddie Pinero gets cut. But Colts made that decision, and I think um, initially the reason why Eddie Pinero was signed by the Colts was because once he got to that 50-yard distance area, that's where Rodrigo Blankenship had some issues. Um, he wasn't perfect. He would miss some kicks. They weren't the greatest, so I thought, okay, they're signing Eddie Pinero because he can clearly kick 50 yards or further. Like He had a really good leg when it comes to that distance, so they're going to sign him in there. They're going to make Hot Rod work to improve that distance, and if he doesn't improve it, then they're going to go with Eddie Pinero because Eddie Pinero is a pretty reliable kicker, but if Rodrigo Blankenship can make those far kicks, then they'll stick with Rodrigo Blankenship and they'll release Eddie Pinero, and on TikTok, of all places, uh, Rodrigo Blankenship has an account, and he released a video of him kicking a 70-yard field goal attempt, I think on Monday in training camp, and he made it pretty easily. It was either Monday or it was the previous week, um, and he made it. And he could have went a little further than that, too. So I think Chris Ballard, Frank Reich saw that and went, okay, uh, he can clearly kick those uh, far kicks. Uh, we're we're going to stick with him, and we're just going to release uh, Eddie Pinero. I, I definitely think that played a factor into it as well. Plus, in the preseason game, he did kick that 47-yard field goal, and it, it, it looked beautiful. You know, it looked really good. So um, both have been perfect. Um, it was going to be really difficult, I think, to make a decision. I think Eddie Pinero is going to be a good kicker in the NFL. Um, but at the end of the day, I think the Colts saw, okay, Hot Rod can make those far kicks, and he can make them you know, with good accuracy. Uh, we're we're going to stick with him. That was our main problem. And we're just going to release Eddie Pinero. I know Eddie Pinero has a cannon on his leg and he can make those kicks. But at the end of the day, um, I think they wanted to stick with Hot Rod. I think that's who they wanted, but they wanted to push him. They wanted to give him a test. They wanted to add competition because competition ultimately makes everybody better in the NFL. And they decided to go with Hot Rod because I think the competition has improved Hot Rod and his kicking. So. Unfortunately, Eddie Pinero gets cut. That's the name of the game. I hate to see it happen. Um, you never want to see a guy get cut and lose his job, but uh, I would be shocked if Eddie Pinero did not get a job in the NFL pretty soon because if you've seen some of the preseason games, the, the kicking has not been too nice in those games. The, there's uh, plenty of teams that are in need of a kicker, to say the least, and um I, I think Eddie Pinero is going to have no problem finding a job, especially after the first two weeks of preseason. So there you guys have it. Thank you all for watching. If you're new, I would greatly appreciate it if you would click the subscribe button. Also, click the bell icon. That way you're notified whenever a video goes up, as well as when we go live here. If you like this video, smash that like button. I would like to get this video to more Colts fans. And how we can do that is by you guys clicking the like button because likes are huge for YouTube. It brings this video to more people. It recommends it to more people. So um, I would greatly appreciate it if you would click the like button, if you liked it anyway. And if you didn't like it, then dislike the video. You know, do that if you want. And uh, let me know in the comments below, what are your thoughts? Should they have went with Eddie Pinero instead of Rodrigo Blankenship? Or do you think the Colts made the right decision by releasing Eddie Pinero? Thank you all for watching. I've been Matt. Bleed Blue. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you watch one of these other two videos. They're cool. Also, if you're new, please click the subscribe button as well as the bell icon. I greatly appreciate your support.